Hello everyone, welcome to another edition of the Beer Vlog, <coughs> excuse me, on Weekly Outrage. My name's Ryan, and as you can tell, I'm kind of I'm kind of hype right now. Got the sunglasses on, got the hat slightly tilted. My Michigan Wolverines are in the championship game. So ready for it. Lost my mind last night when we beat Loyola on that comeback. It was awesome. So I'm ready to get into some beer. So this week. I'm going to be doing the Mega Mix by M A M I A Beer Company, and I just love the can. It's got that '80s design. It's a pale ale, six percent. Um, I believe I've had it in the past. Um, it's been a minute. It's been about a year since I've had it, so I'm ready to dive into some, give it a taste. Um, going straight out of the can, '80s style, and '90s, and now everyone <laughs> drinks out of the can, so. Not really 80 style, but the can is 80 style, so. Ooh, that's sm that smells really good. But that is really good. You can definitely taste the pineapple. The hops are there. That's what I love. I love some hops. Hops are in it. It actually tastes a lot like an IPA. God, it's really good. Taste alone, that is delicious. That is fire. That's a 9 out of 10 right there on taste. So, I'm going to jump into the segment I always do. No! Chandler fell! If y'all haven't been able to tell, I got a Chandler and Captain America. Big Friends fan. Big Marvel fan. And the sunglasses are here for a reason, by the way, you'll find out. But it's not really associated with those. I'm just very ADD. So, Ugh. go ahead and dive into the shotgun. Might be a slower shotgun. I didn't make as big of a hole this time, but cheers. That wasn't too bad. I'm feeling it a little bit. That was good. That was really good. So, shotgun for Mega Mix, I give it a 7 out of 10. It was actually really smooth. It wasn't too bad compared to other IPAs and pale ales I've had in the past. So, if y'all can, definitely get your hands on some Mega Mix because this is a really good pale ale. But if you're an IPA fan, this is going to be more toward your angle. This is where you want to go. So, I guess that's it. No, it's not. So, the sunglasses. I was telling you there's something about these sunglasses. Well, these sunglasses are actually a part of Idle Hounds Brewery. It's one of their swag packs that they gave me when they came to one of our local spots. And because Michigan is in the championship game, and they came back down from a double-digit deficit to win by double digits and tomorrow is the second I'm giving you two reviews so I actually did a shotgun on location with the guys from Idle Hounds Brewery they were pretty cool to hang out with and that video will be shortly after this but so this is another one of their beers that they had us try it's called Incidentals it's New England style Indian Pale Ale it was a very good beer uh, I would rate this one compared to Mega Mix. It's probably about a seven. It's not as good as the Mega Mix, but it is still a great beer. So if you can get your hands on some of these incidentals, that is a good beer that you definitely want to try. But the shotgun I did 
was a double IPA, 8%, called Divide and Conquer. So they're out of Santa Rosa Beach, Florida. So Conk is actually spelled C-O-N-C-H-E-R. It's pretty cool how they did that. And I actually looked up what Idle Hounds is, and it's like a regal dog. But it's just a fancy way of saying a good boy. <laughs> That's just funny to say. So I hope you all enjoy my review. My shotgun, I reviewed that, but my shotgun of the Divide and Conquer shortly after this here in the next 10 seconds but if you'd like please subscribe above you want to see some other videos check it out up here enjoy welcome to weekly outrage my name is Ryan I'm here with Idle Hounds Brewery at Beer Hog as you can see above go ahead and kill one of their beers right here in shotgun a nice open right there as you can tell nice open three two one let's go weekly outrage ryan subscribe like above let's go